Hey everybody, Mark from Northeast Bass Fishing. How are you guys doing? Uh, if you guys saw the teaser that I put up earlier, I did get a couple orders in. I wanted to show you what I got from, from Pure Fishing and from Berkeley uh, that came today. So it's not a big order, so it shouldn't take me long to just go through it, but I wanted to show you this, you guys' stuff before I put it away. I did grab um, a few of the the uh, Berkeley vibratos. Used Sabeel used to make these. Now it's Sabeel, you know, Berkeley bought Sabeel. It's now just a Berkeley bait. And I just buy these vibratos. My buddies that, that like to striper fish like to use these. So whenever I make an order from there, I grab a few for them. So that's the uh, natural shiner and pinkison and the hot lime. So I grabbed a couple of those for my buddies, for my striper buddies. Because hey, you do tend to lose a few of those <laughs> when you're when you're fishing them. Um, so what I got for myself was uh, I just got a new bait for me that's that's new to uh, Berkeley and one that I've had that I've shown you a lot that I like, and I just wanted to get some of the colors in the sizes that I didn't have. And I got I didn't get any of the stunners in the one one twelve plus one. These are all just regular one twelves. And three colors that I like I just didn't I only had in the plus one. <clears throat> And one that I especially like is this Northern Lights color. So I did get, I always forget what a pain in the neck is getting these open. That tape on there. Holy moly. <laughs> it's at least a pain to get it off this little reflective paper they have in there. Because these fusion hooks are sharp. And I do not want a hook in my finger. It's one thing if you're fishing and you get a hook in your finger, but you're showing people baits. Um, I know you guys have seen this before from me, the uh, the stunner in that Northern Lights, and it's really a cool color with that chartreuse on the belly, that green on the back, that purple in there. And the stunner is a nice jerk bait. It's a real nice jerk bait. I've used them a lot the last few years they've, since they've come out. Caught a lot of fish in them. It's a great jerk bait. So that's the. Berkeley Stunna 112 in that Northern Lights color. I also got one in the uh, the Hanky Panky color in the one the 112. I'll try to get this open in a more. <laughs> I should probably just tear it, <laughs> tear the box apart. It's not like it's going back in the box. Holy moly! I should probably just show it to you like this. Here's the Hanky. <laughs> Here's the Hanky Panky. But I'll pull it off here. It's got to come off anyway. Just got to be careful when you take this off. Watch those hooks. Just do one hook at a time. Don't try to grab the whole bait and pull it out of that, that backing. So that hanky-panky color, that white, I really like. I like the orange on the belly. I guess eh, maybe more of a yellow. It's a great color. I have it in the plus one, not the regular 112. So there's the hanky-panky, the Berkeley uh, Stunna 112 in the hanky-panky color. And the last one is that Phenom color, which is really neat. Of course, now the dogs are over there fighting. Not fighting, playing, but barking at each other. I don't know what for. They're just out in the snow running around, so they're a little hyped up. So there, if you haven't seen the Phenom color, in the stunner, it's really cool, that green on there. It looks, I don't know if that's kind of a blue on the back, I think you guys can tell, or a different shade of green. It's hard to tell with those colors blend together there. Would you guys lay down, please? I'm trying to do a video here. What kind of set is this? It's supposed to be a quiet set, but there's the Phenom color in that, uh, that Berkeley 112 stunner, just regular 112. So, the 112 in the Phenom, the 112 in the Hanky Panky, and the 112 in the Northern Lights. Add to the jerkbait arsenal. And a new bait from Berkeley, a newer bait. I don't know when these exactly came out that I didn't have any of. And that's the Berkeley Power Bait, the Cole Shad 6. I got the 6 inch size. That 6 inch uh, swim bait color that you guys have seen me, you know, getting a lot of lately. Here's just the newest one. Now, I don't know. I don't want to. I just screwed up and tore that off, so now I can't hang it up. So let's see what these look like. I have not taken these out of the box. This color here is the HD Ghost Gizzard color. 
HD Ghost Gizzard. So this is on your line of your six inch, you know, like a mag draft type. And uh, as you can see, they've got the hook buried right back up inside there. It looks like just the difference. It looks like it's got like a little clip that holds it in there. Which I don't know if you need to put it in the clip. I don't know if when the if the clip breaks eventually, if it's going to really matter. But you could probably just lay it on top of the, of the clip there. I don't even if you want. If you, I guess if you want to clip it in, you'll feel it clip in. Hmm, different. But that's the internal harness that they have set up for these. It's an interesting idea. But there it is. And what did I say that was? HD Ghost Gizzard. Got that Berkeley Power Bait smell, which is great. Cool color. Nice blues in there. Be curious to see how they swim. But that's what the, the, the six inch coal shad from Berkeley looks like. I don't know if you guys can, you'll be able to see it on the video. It's got that little, there's like a little clip there. You see that hook harness and the, the way they had it set, they had the hook buried here. And just the top of that hook, kind of pop, you hear it click in. I would imagine after a few fish that that clip might not survive, but I don't know. I haven't thrown these yet. They're brand new to me, but always looking to try another six inch uh, swim bait. So that HD, I keep forgetting the color, HD Ghost Gizzard, right? I was going to say ghost, but I thought it was wrong. HD Ghost Gizzard. Pretty cool. Nice looking bait. Now I'm going to try, <laughs> I'll try not to pull the tag off of the next one that uh, to hang this back up since I just ripped the tag off I might be able to just sink it in here and or tape it on and I'll figure it out I'll figure it out and I also got just the HD gizzard so that one is the ghost gizzard this one is just the gizzard you guys can see that in the box and I'll try to take this apart without now, now that I see it there really isn't a way to do it without kind of tearing that little no no I think there is uh, I think there is yep just do it that way Mark it'll work a lot better would you guys stop so here's just your HD gizzard which is kind of cool let's look at them you know what I'll take that I'll take it out I'll show you again I didn't really have it back in there right anyway. So here is the HD Ghost Gizzard. <laughs> and here is the HD Gizzard Shad. It's a little different. So if you look them side by side, they're not that different. This one, the scales are a little different, but pretty cool looking baits. Plastic is pretty tough. Like I said, it's got that great power bait smell. But there you go. So a couple of their gizzard versions I've got. I'll put these back after I'm done with the video. And the last one is good old yellow perch. I did order one other one, but it was it turned out it was out of stock. So if I like these, I'm sure I'll grab a couple more, try them out. Throw it in with that mag draft and those, those optimum ones. So here is... The Berkeley Power Bait, the Cull Shad, six inch Cull Shad in the yellow perch, which is pretty neat. Paint jobs look great. I could see the bass just chomping on that. Hopefully the Northerns won't <laughs> destroy it. But it's got that little clip on the back. If you guys can see how their, their harness is set up. Just bury that one hook in there and swim. You don't want that hook hanging. You grab every little piece of weed or anything you get next to. We'll, we'll entitle this video <laughs> the dog barking video <laughs> all of a sudden they haven't barked all day and now when i'm doing this they have to they're down here playing chasing each other around and now they're barking upstairs oops but they don't want to do that what they're barking at i have no idea probably nothing so the yellow perch just kind of go over everything one more time wrap this up The HD Gizzard Shad, very cool looking.
the HD Ghost Gizzard, which got more blue to it, it seems. Very nice, though. Very nice looking bait. I think they all look good. Let's see how they swim. Actually, I don't think that goes. I think it goes more like that. Yeah, it seems to fit in there a little better. Yeah, that fits in a little better there. And the three stunners, the Phenom. That 112 stunner, Berkeley 112 stunner, the hanky panky in the 112 stunner, and the northern lights in the 112 stunner. So when jerkbait season comes in a few months, they'll be ready to go. So uh, like I said, guys, any questions on any of these, let me know. I will put links to these on the uh, on either the Berkeley site or Pure Fishing site there or or just right where you can get them, like if you order from Tackle Warehouse or Land Big Fisher, wherever you order from. If you're interested in checking them out, now you see what they look like up close. And uh, and that's it. So any questions on the baits, let me know. Now remember, I have not thrown this yet, so I can't compare it to like a Mag Draft or a, or a Zell Dangerous or any of those other ones that I've thrown so far. But uh, once I do, I will definitely uh, definitely show it to you. You know, hopefully there'll be some good on the water action with these. Uh, this season this season so they look cool definitely uh, try it out see how it works so i'll put descriptions of all this stuff where you can get it and and all that good stuff so um please like share the video if you have if this is the first time you've seen any of my videos and you, and you enjoy it please subscribe to the channel you can see more bait reviews i did get another order from tackle warehouse i i might do the order tonight or the order the video tonight um i don't know when i'll get both of these posted but uh you'll see them soon and you can uh, go check these baits out on your own all right so i will see you guys soon on youtube mark out